Today we've been at the Eastman House all day long photographing local individuals who have disabilities of, of all types, all ages. We're really trying to show that difference is okay and that we can embrace difference. I don't think that these are people that are, are have looked in this mirror and decided on their own that you know I'm not beautiful. I'm, they've been told they're not beautiful. They've been they've been not allowed to. They were never been welcomed or invited to join that beauty standard. And what I'm saying is, forget that. I'm not trying to squeeze you under these into these parameters. We're creating our own standard of beauty, and you're involved. You're front row and center on the table, head up, wind in your hair. Show the world your your beauty. And that's what this is about. We're all different, you know, and you can't just look at that person and say, um, yeah, she's different. I don't want her on my team. I don't want her, she's not good, but you can't judge them. You have to, like, like, turn it around and say, oh, well maybe I should pick her. I want to give her a chance to play with us. Not everybody is um, perfect or normal, but that's what in in inclusion is. Inclusion is something that we all want. Nobody wants to be left out. Nobody wants to be excluded. People with disabilities throughout history have been isolated, excluded, left out of mainstream society. You know, it's not okay to bully dump on people that have disabilities. Um, pick, put yourself in their shoes and see how they would feel if they were bullied. If everyone would just think about what it feels like to be excluded, to be alone, to be made fun of, it hurts. The individuals who were photographed today have tremendous challenges in their life every day. They're fighters, they're self-directed, self-advocates, they were selected because of that inner strength, they never give up. They were wonderful, wonderful stories of self-determination and, and, and grit in the face of so many life challenges.